We propose a method uh, called the main, uh, it's divided in, in four uh, phases, uh, in, it, to help uh, to, uh, teachers in order to, to do innovation in, in the experience. Uh, the four phases are, uh, the first one is to identify uh, the context and what is the root problem for the, to do the, the innovation, uh, what students uh, have this, that, those uh, problems, and the uh, uh, impact indicators, to decide what impact indicators to, to be measured, and uh, to know the applied method more adequate to, the, to this innovation, and identify the processes, uh, I mean ingredients, uh, activities, uh, tools, and of course uh, what technology will be more adequate to, to, the, to the innovation, to that innovation. And the, the last phase, uh, is focused in the strategies, uh, depending on the uh, objectives, academic objectives. In that sense, uh, the, this is the relation between the phases, the root problems. Uh, from the root problem, uh, we decide the improvement indicators. Uh, we decide uh, or we choose uh, the, the best innovation method, and we uh, decide the ingredients, activities, and technology. And at the end, the strategies. Um, in the, in the paper is uh, explaining that this uh, method in one uh, specific uh, case is uh, an active methodology, is the flip teaching methodology. And in, with respect to the, the last phase, uh, I, I mean uh, that the, I want to say that it depends on the on the objectives. Uh, if, we, if we want if we want uh, to innovate in only in our subject, we only need to create habit, new habits in the students or change the role of the students. If uh, the objective is uh, at the, in the, the field of uh, university uh, for, to, obtain, uh, to improve educate, educative uh, indicators, uh, it's, need, it's needed to, to do uh, good practices. And if uh, the objective is to go publish in a conference uh, journal, or, or journal, it's uh, necessary to create a scientific publication, not only the innovation. Uh, in, that, in that sense, uh, we, de, uh, we did a uh, uh, survey with uh, eight uh, questions and 41 new university teachers, uh, uh, participants in a course about uh, the main method uh, in three universities, uh, um, uh, fulfilled uh, this uh, survey and we obtained in, for, the, for, uh, for the eight uh, questions um, well, this is the box uh, uh, diagram, uh, and the, the questions were measured uh, by Likert, ranked uh, five. And uh, well, the conclusions of this uh, uh, work is that uh, uh, we, we we see that uh, the teachers uh, have uh, real problems, real problems uh, to predict, or the impact of the innovation in the, in the question. And the rest of the questions obtained a value of four or five, the maximum value um, of, from the 50% of participants and at least the 75% of participants gave a value from three to, to five. They, they, uh, they were uh, very good uh, uh, results and in consequence uh, the main method can be used as a guide to, the, to do a free teaching experience in this case, because this, is, this was the example uh, with using uh, free teaching, the main method is a useful tool to do free teaching experiences. The main method supports uh, technology evolution. The main method makes easy the methodological innovation of free teaching. It also allows uh, transfer free teaching experiences to other uh, uh, subjects. It's uh, very easy to follow in the following the, the phases of the, of the method and uh, at the end uh, this method makes easy to the subsequent scientific dissemination. It's easier to prepare the papers and scientific papers following all of these uh, stages of this, uh, of this method. So, thank you very much. <laughs>